I'm looking for it, Mom. It's got to gotta be in here somewhere um uh no i can't i can't find the lost copyright strike um it's in there i know it's in there and we both saw it um i may ate it i think i ate it sorry mom i ate your copyright strike <laughs> okay guys yeah we are looking for the missing copyright strike we got our first copyright strike huh foxy yeah yay and what that means is if we get two more, we will have a channel. Also, yay! And, um, we're looking for it. We did a VR title for you. I did it. Little, little Foxy wanted to help, but, um, we thought it would be too cringe to let him start playing games again. Yeah, we thought it would be too cringe. You need to get in front of my face to keep the illusion going. Sorry, Mom. <laughs> okay, and anyhow, anyhow. We put up this VR title for you. It was the Haunted House one. It was the one I got really upset and I made a rage video about. I got a strike. And I got a notification from um, YouTube in my email. And I thought it was the company that made the game that gave me the strike. I'm like, oh, holy crap. I did not mean to do that. Why would you talk about YouTube Let's Plays of your previous version of your game if you didn't want to play? But that wasn't the case. No. Okay. You, you you helped a lot. Thank you, Foxy. Welcome. <laughs> Anyhow. Okay, guys. Enough silliness. Anyhow. There. I went and I took the video down. And I'm like, oh my god. Oh my god. I'm losing my channel. I got my first strike and things come to threes, right? I go to look at my status. Because when I go to delete the video, YouTube tells me that's not getting rid of your copyright strike. I'm like, okay, I gotta look for my copyright strike, and it disappeared. Now, I don't know if they had originally gave me a strike and lifted it and just let the video be blocked. Because they realized it was a Let's Play, but they weren't going to be backing down from having done this to my channel, or what it was. But it was this company that claims, I say claims in quotation mark, to represent artists, and they were trying to destroy my channel over a song in a video game. Sounds familiar, right? Remember all the times AdRef kept uh, putting stuff on my videos because I was playing Five Nights at Freddy's and claimed they owned the rights to the music. And they don't, by the way. <laughs> like, Scott's never said, came out and said anything, but as far as I know, AdRef doesn't own the rights to the music in his games. Anyhow. We got this block, and now I've been looking for it, and it's gone. Well, the block's gone because I took the video down. But the strike mysteriously disappeared. I don't know if they lifted it. But we were going crazy. Because I thought it was the game company themselves that did it. And it was just people claiming they own the rights to the music. And it's another one of those annoying music rights companies. That shows up, starts handing out stuff they have a claim to have the right to. To YouTube. And then they block one of your videos or they have a uh, strike on you and you only hear of them once you get a strike or a block and then you look them up on YouTube and the only videos they have are videos that they gave to YouTube courteously and they claim they own the music rights and it's just it's kind of fishy because they always show up out of nowhere and they claim they're a company with decades of experience and all of a sudden they're like trying to shut your channel down so we had our excitement no more VR for a while. Yeah, no more VR for a while. You're not standing in the place you need to stand, Foxy. Sorry, well. <laughs> Anyhow. Um, yeah, our camera's kind of shot, or we would have done back and forth on the camera. But that is where the channel stands right now. I don't know if they're going to then put the strike back on, which means I only need two more before I don't have any channel at all on YouTube. They will just take everything down. Every video I've ever made will be gone. That's how they do it. And you won't see me anymore. So, no more VR. Yeah, we have like one VR title scheduled. And I'm kind of iffy to release that. Because if this is our new game to put strikes on you. And then lift them once your content you take the content down. I'm kind of afraid to do, you know, anything involving VR. Is that what this company is after? I don't know. But, yeah. We are kind of looking for that strike and seeing if it shows up again. So that's where we are. Looking for a strike. If you've seen a copyright strike, let us know. If you found it, keep it. 
<laughs> okay, guys, we will see you later. Bye-bye.